Good morning everybody, how are we doing today? It's Cindy Utter with my Artsy Endeavors and it's time for our 55 faces. Um, I've got two cards out here, let's see what number they are. They are number, this must be 17 and 18, yeah that was last week, 17 and 18. So we're on number 19 and 20. So let's get our dates on here just so that I remember. A little basket here of things I use quite a bit, so I just throw junk in it. See, isn't this adorable? I got this the other day in the mail. Totally unexpected, unexpected surprise. All right, so we've got number 19 and number 20. All right, so I wonder who's going to come to us today. I think what I'm going to do is just start drawing, and I have nothing in mind. I have no idea where these are going. I'm just going to play right that's what it's all about so and I know next week or the week after I want to start working on um, a side view of a face but for today I'm just gonna play so let's see what we've got I don't know is today's gonna be realistic I don't know if it's gonna be whimsical I don't know let's see what happens so yesterday I spent the day with my friend shopping um, trying to get some of this Christmas stuff done oh my goodness um, you know, I, I love Christmas. It's one of my favorite holidays, but boy, I'm, I'm ready for, for it to be done. <laughs> so we took my granddaughter the other night. We took her up to, um, they have a place called Lights on the Lake. And it's basically just hundreds and hundreds of lights, Christmas lights. They have, a uh, Oh, let's see. They have a Wizard of Oz area. They have a sports area. They have just all kinds of wonderful Christmas lights. So we took her up to see that, and it was a surprise for her. She was so excited. Why do my lips always look so huge? I don't know. We're going to cut them down, though, aren't we? And I think my cat just knocked over some wrapping paper. That's all right. All right, so here we go. My lips are huge! Alright, we're racing on this one. <laughs> They're just too big. I don't know what it is. I like to do big lips. That's better. She's interesting, isn't she? Let's see what we can do here. Let's just use some of this and get some shadows going in here. I'm gonna get use some of the the graphite and just get some shadows. Let's see what we can do here. This may end up just being a pencil sketch. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. here eyebrows here so anyways um, we took her up to see these lights on the lake and she just oh my gosh she loves it and and I'm sorry if I've told you about this before I can't remember that's one thing with taking the medications that I take it's memory gets shot here and there but anyways um, she had such a good time and it was just a lot of fun my husband and I had never been up there so it was really cool for us to see as well and um, it was really nice, really, really nice. It was like 10 bucks for the car load, which was just the three of us. And uh, there were just so many different lights. And it was, it was really neat. We had a great time. So anyways, um, yesterday I spent the day with my, one of my best friends. And um, we went shopping. I think I'm pretty well done with everybody, I think. I think, I think, I think. Just throwing in some color here. Okay, I don't like how dark she is, but that's okay. 
right, let's, what are we going to do for her hair today? Uh, let's give her, hmm, I always start out the same way. That's good, right there. I like her. I like her. I like her. Okay, let's make her darker through here. Give her some definition. Darker through here. A little bit darker in here. I'm just playing. Um, and again, practicing. I just, I, you know, it's fun. There's just something about playing. It's funny because some of these pencils that I buy, like at the dollar store, some of them will give you um, this, the, the graphite to work with. Other ones, um, it, it doesn't seem to give as much graphite to work with. So I don't know. Cheaper leads or whatever. Hmm. She's kind of homely. <laughs> Alright, what are we going to do for her? we got to find a name for her, as, as usual. Don't know what it's going to be yet. Alright, now let's just kind of darken up her eyes a little. Practice, practice, practice. That's what we're doing, right? I hope you all are enjoying this practice. I know I am. Um, anything that can help me make a face that looks a little bit better, <laughs> um, why not? So I'm just going to kind of... Just loosen up those lines a little bit. So far I'm liking her. These lips I still have issues with. But that's okay. That's what practice is for. Just get these lips a little bit better. Over. Huh. I think she looks like a Sue. Have I already done a Sue? She looks like a Sue. Yeah, with a helmet head. <laughs> Here, we'll give her some texture in her hair. Make your hair look kind of not quite so, not quite so. I like her. I like her. Now this is um, um, drywall tape. And I love using this stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take a piece of this. You know what? I think we're just going to put some texture on here. Go back here, you. And, okay, just a little bit of texture here and there for her. Just because I can, right? Okay, 
think I'm going to use this on the other one too. So, And I've got some uh, Neo colors here. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take my Neo colors. I like her. I like her. I like her. Um, I'm going to take my Neo colors and give her some color here. Let's start out with pink. I'm in a pink mode today. Give her some pink. She's going to stay the way she is. And let's do a little bit of light purple. And then what I'm going to do, instead of activating this with water, which, as you know, I have a hard time when I do the activating with water, which would be the water brush. Um, I was looking to see if I had a brush in there, and I don't. I'm actually going to activate this with gesso. So I'm just going to take a little bit of white gesso here on my mat. And I'm going to wet my brush. And I'm going to use a little bit of this gesso, a little bit of water here, a little bit of gesso. And we're going to wake up our colors. And I love the way the gesso um, makes them alive, yet they're calm. It gives them that opaqueness. Love it. So just a little bit of fun. You know, if you want to um, do something different with your neo colors, it's great to... Uh, use different mediums to activate them. My water is dirty. I need to get some clean water. Now, I don't mean to offend anybody when I made the comment that she is homely. That's just because my girl, I drew her. She's kind of, eh. She's all right. Um, so when I name her Sue, please don't take it personal. It's not that I think anybody is homely. I think everybody is beautiful in their own way. Whoa, and I have a kitty cat. This is Abby. Look up, Abadoo. Look up, Abadoo. She's not looking up. She wants to join me. Down. Yeah. She seems to think she wants to come up here and play. A little stinker boo. Do a little bit more of the purple down in here. And I like her. I love her. So what do you think? Think she's a Sue? Yeah, why not? She's a Sue. All right, we're going to set her aside to dry for a little bit. And while she's drying, we're going to draw another girl. Let's see. This one I want. I, I know all my girls are different, but this one we're going to try to do a little bit different here. <clears throat> this one we're going to do a little bit bigger. Whoops. See, now those two eyes are not the same shape at all. But I guess if you think about it, nobody's two eyes are the same shape. We'll just make her a little bit. There we go. funny I always start the same exact way and it's just 
almost like I've gotten myself into a routine on how I draw faces. I just need to work on the lips. I need to work on the noses. No, actually, the lips, when you, when you actually feel your face, your lips come right up to almost the middle of your eyes. The corner of your mouth comes right up to the middle of your eyes. So that would be a great reference. So know that the corner of the mouth comes right about to the middle of the eyes. All right, she's going to be quite large. Bigger face here. And we're going to do neck here. And let's see. If I did a sue. Now I need to know. Did I do a sue? I'm going to do Jane, Liz, Sabrina, Sarah. Why am I doing a lot of S's? Ruby, Lily, Faith, Veronica, Shannon, Brittany, Stacy, Kate, Lucy. Okay, I have not done a sue. All right. So she's a sue. And let's see what we can do with her. Again, I'm just going to use the graphite that I've put down from the, um, I need to give her eye color, from the uh, pencil. A little bit too much there. Okay. Seems to have a long face. I really need to fix the end of my thingy here because it's getting in pretty rough shape. Pretty rough shape. All right, we're gonna fix that. Okay, her lips. I'm just gonna put shadows here, maybe. Now my kitty cat's talking. Can you hear? So they were meow. She's looking for mama. Do, 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 do. So anyways, as I was saying, are you guys ready for, for your holiday? I am so ready. Ready for it to be done. <laughs> no, I can't say that. It's going to be great because we're going to have... <clears throat> I'll have my son here, one of my sons. And... Um, and some friends over and we'll just have really nice dinner. I'm gonna do ham. Isn't that what everybody eats on things on Christmas? I know a lot of people do. <clears throat> so that's what I'm having. Okay, this is gonna be all hair. This is all hair. All hair. I like the sound effects. Hmm? <laughs> I always seem to have sound effects. <clears throat> hmm. 
and she's not going to have very, very much room for color. She may end up just being uh, the way she is. She may, she may. <coughs> but, you know, I do want to use... Let's play, shall we? Um, I'm actually going to take the flesh. Is this flesh tone? Yes, it is. I'll put some flesh tone here on my mat. Oops. And I'm actually going to take a little bit of water, a little bit of this gesso, and my flesh tone. We're going to play. Why not? Give her some color. Just a touch of that just so. Just to give her a little bit of color. And of course the graphite is also moving, um, which is okay. It's more down here on my mat. And my girl's back over here yelling at me. What's up, Abadoo? Huh? What's up, darling? What's up, Abadoo? You can't come up here yet. I'm as busy. She says, I don't think so. I like her. She's sketchy looking. I like that sketchy look. Right? Pretty cool, huh? I like that sketchy look. I'll take just a touch of the gesso. Give her some white right here. Give her some white right here. <coughs> Pardon me. A frog in my throat. <clears> throat. Last couple of days, my husband and I both noticed that we're real froggy, and uh, we wonder if it's this weather or you know if we're coming down with colds. I hope not. I hope no colds. give her some color on her lips. Let's give her a little bit of pink. Just a little bit. Um, not sure what her name is, but I like her. <clears throat> and she's going to have, oh, must be I broke that one, let's give her some black. Her hair has got to be black. Come back here, you. What's her name? Hmm. What is her name? The name Erin came to me, so her name is Erin. Spelling it E-R-I-N. I don't know if that makes any difference, but that's what she wants. <coughs> She's funny looking. <laughs> 
She's definitely funny looking. That's all right. We don't mind, do we? I like her. I like her. She's kind of sketchy looking. She's definitely not perfect, but who is? Take a touch of this white. Just barely touching these lips. I don't want a big white blob, but I would like some white gesso right there. Just kind of a highlight. She looks manly. <laughs> <clears throat> I have to laugh. Can give her some pupils. I'm just playing right now. I'm just using a little bit of that black that's on my paintbrush, just messing around with her. Um, just having fun. That's all. That, that that's what it's about. Let's have fun. And I need a different paintbrush. Let's play. Let's play. So, it's funny, I did not ask for any art supplies for Christmas. None. I figure I have enough. Enough to play with. Hmm. <clears throat> not a fan of her, but hey, we're not going to make masterpieces every time, are we? This one definitely is not a masterpiece, but she's fun. Why not? You know? She's fun. So we have Aaron and we have Sue. Aaron and Sue. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, let's go back in with a pencil. I gotta give her some color in her eyes. Give her some color. There we go. Let's give her and Sue some color in their eyes. Apparently, I'm not going to do this to this one, which is cool. Um, I always seem to go toward blue. Let's make them green today. I always go toward blue or green because my eyes are brown. And I actually at one point had, um, blue contacts. But really, because my eyes are so brown, it, um, didn't really cover up the brown. So it was kind of a waste of money, actually, but hey. It was fun wearing blue contacts for a while. Okay, I like her. That's Erin. And we're going to give Sue green eyes, too. Just a touch of green. Now I want 
her black pupils to stand out. So I'm going to pull up some of this black. Just give her just enough so they stand out a little bit more. She looks funny with green eyes and uh, nothing else. Huh. All right, but you know what? That's okay. Because, <clears throat> where is my ink pen? Now ah, let's do it in black gesso today. I have black gesso and a fine liner here. This is Sue. Make sure I can get it working. <laughs> That's Sue. And this is Aaron. All right, so today we have Sue and Aaron. Um, I hope you have fun. Again, remember, it's practice, it's play. We don't have to have them perfect. Um, that's not what we're looking for. So as always, be kind, have fun. That's what life's all about. And happy creating. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.